weeks of fiery debate in Morehouse Parish, the school board voted no to closing two elementary schools. Fox 14's Chelsea Jones sat down with Superintendent Dr. David Gray, who says the school system is still on the road to being broke, but the state won't allow it. Good evening, Chelsea. Good evening, Sarah. School Superintendent Dr. David Gray tells me the state doesn't want to get involved. It prefers the school board find its own solution. One man is suing to give the community a seat at the table. Monday night's Morehouse Parish school board meeting ended with the answer no to closing schools. But with the over $1.6 million deficit, it still leaves the question, what's next? I hate that we're going through this. They're horrible times. So Superintendent Dr. David Gray says he wants to create a plan everyone can live with. But many say they want the state to get involved. Dr. Gray says that's the last thing they want to do. One local pastor says it's time the community gets a seat at the table. Why wouldn't the state get involved? The state over education. So he filed a lawsuit asking that the board, the community, and the state come up with a plan together for the best interest of students. We have two plans we need to develop. We have a short-term plan we need to take care of to get through the school year. We need to establish that. Then we need to have a long-term plan. One plan is a loan, the other asking voters for a sales tax. This community welcomed that lawsuit. Ricky Anderson is collecting signatures to present to Governor John Bell Edwards for help. Then we can go to the table and say we had everybody's opinion. Let's put our brains together and figure out what we need to do best for these kids. Superintendent Gray says the clock is ticking. A plan needs to be made by the first two weeks of December, and he doesn't see a plan that prevents closing schools. Unfortunately, I don't see how we can possibly avoid it with the, the size of the deficit. It's not our wants, it's our needs, and that's what we should be focused on. I think we're going to get through this. I think we're going to be fine. As opposed to talking about dollars and cents, we can talk about letter grades and we can talk about kids performing in academics. Dr. Gray says the board attorney is aware of the lawsuit and is advising him what to do along the way. Live in the studio, Chelsea Jones, Fox 14 News.